it comes to creatine, what's the right dosage? How much should we be taking and for how long? Let's figure it out together. Hi, my name is Maya Valenti with Naked Nutrition. I'm a private chef and nutrition coach here to answer all your questions on health and supplementation. Many people worry if they stop taking creatine that they'll lose the muscle gained while taking creatine. So let's discuss whether the evidence supports this. While creatine can help to increase muscle mass and strength, the gains may not be permanent. This will all depend heavily on your training regimen and nutrition after stopping creatine supplementation. When you stop taking creatine, your muscle mass and strength may gradually decrease. This is not due to muscle loss, but instead water loss. One study published in the Journal of Strength and Conditioning Research found that creatine supplementation increased total body water content by about three pounds with the majority of the increase occurring in muscle water content. You may lose some muscle, but the loss should not be significant. Another thing people wonder about stopping creatine is whether they will have less energy for intense exercise. Creatine helps provide the energy needed for high intensity exercise. So it's not uncommon to worry that you'll feel more fatigued without it. The effects of creatine supplementation on energy levels are temporary and your body will adapt to the absence of creatine over time. One study found that supplementing with creatine increased phosphocreatine content and improved performance during high intensity exercise, but these effects were still noticeable after stopping creatine supplementation. You could take another supplement like BCAAs to increase stamina for intense exercise. When you stop taking creatine, you might have weight loss due to the loss of water weight that was gained during creatine supplementation. This is because creatine causes muscle cells to hold more water, which can lead to temporary weight gain. And when you stop taking creatine, the excess water from the muscle is lost, resulting in a loss of body weight. While this may initially be discouraging to those who are used to seeing temporary weight gain while taking creatine, it's important to remember that this weight loss is simply the loss of extra water weight and does not reflect a loss of muscle mass. It's still possible to maintain muscle mass through proper nutrition and exercise after stopping creatine supplementation. So can you stop taking creatine forever? Well, you can stop taking creatine supplements forever whenever you want to. When you stop taking creatine, your body will resume to its normal production of creatine. You may experience a decrease in strength, endurance, and performance, but this difference likely won't be drastic. Stopping creatine supplementation is safe and can be done anytime you like. You may experience a slight decrease in strength, performance, and body weight, but the impact should not be significant. There is no set timeline for how long you can or should take creatine supplements. It's important to be mindful of your own health and goals and decide when you wanna start or stop creatine use based on what's best for you. For more information on our Naked Creatine, check us out at nakednutrition.com. And for more informative videos like this one, make sure to subscribe because here at Naked Nutrition, we're nutrition with nothing to hide.